So, uh, yeah, any boat enthusiasts, there's our display. And uh, we can look at the temperature of the controller and how much power we're doing. 35 degrees because we've got a, a marvellous liquid cooling system on board. Thanks to Jay, who um, has got some crazy heat exchange system in there. We're pulling about 9.6 kilowatts. Uh, what's interesting is the speed RPM is 3,225. So that's way below base speed, which means it should be on its premium plateau of efficiency around about this mark. Between three and 4,000 is the most efficient spots. Everything above that, you're losing about 5% because of the torque curve, but here is really good. It sounds happy. We've also got the control gear in here, which is a throttle connected to the throttle system around the side here that you can see. Um, and that operates a forward and reverse. Uh, the motor and everything in there working, the belt drive. This is in, but it's got a 48 volt drivetrain, 400 amp per hour battery system in it. It has our CEM cost effective motor and it's liquid cooled, which is great. It's going to get a handle on how we steer it into the wind. 96 and stabilising. There. I think we're actually on the last bit of the airboat actually. I stand for the... Yeah, I think she's still ebbing a little bit. She's what? Ebbing. Tide ebbing is going out, flooding is coming back in. Ah, uh, right, okay. So actually, we've just caught been pushing against the tide to get here very slightly. Just very slightly. And now uh, the tide is uh, going to turn shortly. So we've still got the tide behind us. Which is really good news. <laughs> yeah. 